everyone welcome back i hope you guys are doing well so in this video i'm going to show you how i like to do my pedicure at home i'm doing this video in association with nika and they had sent me this device right here called peditrix and i have been super duper lazy about it okay so i am the last person to do a pedicure to be honest because i am extremely lazy i'm not even kidding i don't go to the parlor to do it i sometimes don't do it at home and if you guys follow me on snapchat then you must know how long this has been lying around with me uh, i think i got it at the end of april i think and it has been more than two months now so let me talk about this a little bit before we move on to the actual pedicure. So this is an electric foot file and you can use this to get rid of excess dead skin. It can get rid of corns and it can get rid of calluses as well. And it comes along with a complimentary box of disposable pads that has four different grit levels. Grit number 60 is used to remove corns and tough cracks. Grit number 80 is used to remove deep cracks. Grit number 120 is used to smoothen dry and tough rough skin and grit number 180 is used for skin polishing and removing dead skin. It also comes in two speed setting. The low speed is for the upper part of your feet that is your toes and everything and the high speed is for your heels. You can use this without even soaking the leg. You don't have to do exactly what I did in this video. You can just spray some water to dampen your leg and you have to do that because uh, the rubbing of the machine on your feet feet can cause a little friction and then it can turn a little hot so just make sure that you dampen your leg very well before you use this and also it does not really hurt at all it's completely painless and most importantly it does not tickle at all oh my god that is like the weirdest feeling that feeling when somebody else is like rubbing on your legs and you can't even squirm or anything oh i just this just gives me the jitters so yeah without any further ado if you guys would want to know how i like to do my pedicure then keep on watching now the first thing that i'm going to do is fill up half the bucket using lukewarm water and then i'm going to add in my loxitan almond oil char gel this is very nourishing and hydrating Next, I'm going to add in few drops of oil. This is the first essential herb infused oil. And then I'm going to add in one teaspoon of salt and then foam up the water. Next, I'm going to place in my feet and I'm going to keep it there inside the water for somewhere around 15 to 20 minutes. And then after 15, 20 minutes, just remove your feet and wash them off. Next, I'm going to exfoliate my feet using the Peditrix electric foot file and it has an on and off button and has two speed settings, low and high. It comes with this rubber thing that you need to insert. You also get disposable filing pads along with this machine and there are four different types of it depending on the harshness and today I'm going to use the number 80. All you have to do now is attach the pad onto the head of the machine. If you get disgusted very easily, now is the time for you to look away but I'm going to use the filer to exfoliate my heels and make sure that you always keep your feet damp. You can even spray water on it, you don't have to soak your feet to use this. I'm just using circular motion to get rid of the excess dead skin and as you can see there's like a lot of dead skin coming out and once you are done with it, your heels feel extremely soft. You can dispose of the pad once you're done using it and this keeps it really hygienic. You can share it with your family or even with your roommates. Now I like to scrub my legs afterwards and I'm going to use the Forest Essential Body Polish and I just like to scoop out a little bit and use that to scrub my feet once again. I like to do this after because um, it has a really nice oil and it just leaves the skin feeling really moisturized. Next, I'm going to remove my nail polish and then I'm going to add instant cuticle remover. This one's by Sally Hansen and apply that all around my cuticles. As you'll notice, I have really discolored nails because of using too much nail polish and once my nail completely came off. So yeah, then you can cut your nails and file it if you want. And then I'm just going to push in my nail bed a little bit. 
and then you can go ahead and trim your cuticles using a cuticle trimmer you don't have to use this if you have a cuticle remover like the Sally Hansen one I'm just showing this so that you guys can use this instead then I'm going to apply nail polish, my favorite, you guessed it, Uptown Blue by Maybelline and I am just going to paint my nails now. Once the nail polish is dry, I'm going to take my Body Shop Spa of the World Hawaiian Kukui Cream. I love this cream. It is so thick, very hydrating, very nourishing and I'm just going to massage this all over my feet. You can even polish your feet after you've applied the cream. I'm just using the Grit 180 to polish my skin now and this is going to give you that extra baby soft skin. And now my feet feels as soft as a baby's bum. So yeah, that's all for this video. That's how I like to do my pedicure and I was literally touching my feet like continuously once I was done polishing it like after applying the cream and I'm not just saying it for the sake of this video honestly like honestly my legs felt so soft. So the Pedatrix is priced at rupees 5000 originally but right now it's on discount on Nykaa. Um, it's for rupees 3499 and um, if you think it's a little expensive I will agree with you but it's something that you can use for an extended period of time and you can even share it with your family or you can share it with your flatmates if you are in a hostel or something like that and it's something that actually works. So yeah that's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and i'll see you in my next one bye